Okay, so I'm making an attempt to record a video while we are walking. Uh, we, that's me and the dogs, <laughs> if you can see them. <clears throat> um, I will probably not have time to get out uh, this weekend, out in the woods. But I'm here now and uh, this is a wonderful and very small forest called uh, Kajas forest, Kajadunden here in Norway, uh, lots of beech trees and uh, it's a nature reserve so this is how the woodlands is supposed to look like. It is truly beautiful here. And we're going to walk through this very small forest and down towards the sea. <clears throat> if I can get the dogs to cooperate. Come here now. Um, yes, I, I want to talk about toughness again. Uh, so this video goes into that series of tough videos. <laughs> toughness videos <clears throat> um, and I haven't talked about physical toughness yet so I'm going to do that now as I've said before not because I'm so tough but because I think it's important um, and uh, there are lots of people out there and there will be in some in the comments uh, who will claim that they are quite tough and uh, some people are tough, uh, some people are less tough, but we can all get tougher. <laughs> um, it's a process. I believe um, we first have to understand why it's important, why it matters, and then we need to take steps so that we can improve ourselves uh, when it comes to being tough. Now physical toughness I think we all have some idea what that is, but uh, you know, we are as human beings, we are fragile. We are fragile beings. And for instance, I, I'm quite used to being out in the cold. So uh, some people would say, well, that I'm very tough because I don't, I don't get cold out in the winter forest and so on. But that's, that's just because I, I'm used to that, you know. If you put me in a desert, I would probably suffer. <laughs> Toughness comes with practice. And I, I think physical exercise needs to be a part of your life. It needs to be... Uh, oh, now we have this going on again. Uh, you know, I'm not going to say, because I can't say here on YouTube that you should expose yourselves to certain situations and so on. I can't say that. So whatever you do, you know, make sure that it's uh, safe and uh, healthy. Um, but I do think that we should try to find things that challenge us. So, uh, for instance, I, I like to lift weights. I've done that all my life. and. Uh, I like to get stronger. I like to lift heavier weights, so I challenge myself that way. Uh, of course, I'm not as strong now as I was a few years ago, um, but uh, I do my best. And it's that process where you strive towards improving yourself. That process, I believe, makes you tougher. So, what's the opposite of being physically tough? I guess I would choose the word weak, weakness. Um, again, it's not about being big and strong. It's not about, hold on, it's not about being, uh, you know, the, oops, a little bit icy here, slippery. It's not about being, uh, you know, that guy who always 
brags about all the you know, things he, he has done, uh, the mountains he has climbed and all that. It's not about that. That's not being tough, that's just being childish, if you ask me. Um, we need to understand that if we do not incorporate toughness into our lives, we might become weak if we do not take steps to improve ourselves when it comes to toughness and uh, bringing physical exercise um, into our lives, we might become weak and weaker as the years go by. If you get tougher physically, through that process, through the exercise, through exposing yourself to those situations, um, you will also become mentally tougher and stronger. I've reached the end of the, the forest actually and I'm going to walk across this windy path here over to the forest on the other side of the field. So I'll do that now. Now I would say that um, without mental toughness you can never be physically tough because you won't have the, the right attitude. You won't be able to withstand uh, whatever you know is demanded of you. Uh, you won't be able to go through the hardships if you don't have the, the right attitude. The, wrong, the right mental state. Uh, you must be able to put yourself in that mental state uh, whenever it is needed. I also find that tough people, truly tough people, they tend to be uh, humble. And actually I have also found that truly tough people, and I have met a few of those in my life, they tend to be kinder than other people. That might surprise some of you, but um, maybe it's because they know uh, how tough things can be, how tough things can get. Uh, they've been there, they've seen that, you know. Maybe it's a little bit of that. Um, so there you have it. Um, Fiscal toughness, very much linked to mental toughness and the other way around, as I just said. Um, there's a common theme in these videos um, that you might have noticed. It's about what you can do. It's about how you can improve yourself. And I think this is important, especially in a time like this, when there's a lot of blaming others. Uh, and we, we see it, you know, everywhere. Oh, it's, it's so, everything is so polarized. And it seems like people, they, they prefer to blame others. They prefer to blame something or someone outside of themselves, right? And I've, uh, I've mentioned this before, but you know, it's, it's very... <sighs> you, you know, we can't change the world. Well, a little bit maybe. Maybe we can change the world a little bit, but 
you can't change other people. There's a saying that you, you know, you can't change other people, but you can change yourself. And uh, at least it's much easier to change yourself because you have full control, right, of yourself. So you can get tougher. You can get mentally and physically tougher, and you you can improve yourself in in every possible way. You know, one step at a time. And uh, yeah, we are now approaching the beach and uh, let's turn the camera around uh, I would like to say that also I would like to add that um, I I very much appreciate that you're following my channel and watching these videos it's quite important to me actually so I want to thank you for that Um, yeah, this is actually a, quite a demanding day for me, emotionally, because of different reasons. But uh, I'll get through it. There is no giving up. There is no giving in. And uh, yeah, okay. Now here's the beach.